I'm not a man to point or judge, to bury a will or hold a grudge, but I think it's time I said a few choice words. About that demon, the automobile, the metal monster with the polyglass wheels, the end result of a dream of Henry Ford's. Sure, I've got a car that's mine alone that me and the finance company own, a ready-made pile of manufactured grief. If I'm not out of gas in the pouring rain, I'm changing a flat in a hurricane, and I once spent three days lost on a clover leaf. Well, it's not just the smoke of the traffic jam that makes me the bitter fool I am, but that four-wheel buggy's a dollar in me to death. Pour gas and oil and fluids and grease and wires and tires and antifreeze and then them accessories, well, that's something else. You can get stereo tape and color TV, backseat bar and reclining seats on top of those easy monthly payments. I figure that over a period of time, this $4,000 car of mine costs $17,000.50. Well, Lord, Mr. Ford, I just wish that you could see what your simple horseless carriage has become. But it seems your contribution to man, to say the least, got out of hand. Lord, Mr. Ford, what have you done? Now the average American father and mother own one whole car and half of another, and I'll bet that half a car's a bitch to drive. But the thing that amazes me, I guess, is the way we measure a man's success by the kind of automobile that he can buy. Well, this red light, green light, traffic cop, right turn, no turn, must turn, stop, get out the credit card, it's time for gas. All the cars of the world placed end to end would reach to the moon and back again, and there'd probably be some fool pull out to pass. Well, Lord, Mr. Ford, I just wish that you could see what your simple horseless carriage has become. Oh, how I yearn for the good old days without that carbon monoxide haze a hanging over that roar on the interstates. Well, if the Lord that made the moon and stars would have meant for me and you to have cars, he'd seen that we were born with a parking space. Well, Lord, Mr. Ford, I just wish that you could see what your simple horse this carriage has become. This world was once a garden spot, but now it's one big parking lot. Lord, Mr. Ford, what have you done? Lord, Mr. Ford, what have you done? Come away with me, Lucille, in my smoking, choking, naughty mobile.